everyone! Welcome back to my channel. Today's video is going to be a what's in my purse. I recently got a new bag that I am head over heels with. I love it. I have saved up for a very long time to get this bag. If you follow me on Instagram, you already know what bag that is. But it's so beautiful. Let me show you. Okay. Definitely not going to go the way of the fire. Okay, so this is my new bag. It is a Louis Vuitton Neverfull. I got it in the medium size. I'm pretty sure it's called the MM. I will leave details down below for you guys, but I absolutely love it. Um, it's just in a classic monogram. And then the inside is this gorgeous hot pink color. It's definitely what sold me on the bag. So before I get into the contents of everything that I keep in here, I do want to give you guys kind of like the background and why I picked out this bag and stuff. So I bought my first Louis Vuitton bag um, a long time ago, a few years ago, and it's the uh, Speedy 30, I believe. I have a whole video, like what's in my purse on that one. I'll leave it down below if you guys want to check it out. But I bought that bag. I love that bag. I think it's just classic Louis Vuitton. And the only problem I have with that bag is that it's really uncomfortable to hold. It gets really heavy, and especially when I first bought it, I was having really bad wrist problems, not due to the purse, but due to other things. I had tendonitis in my wrist, and it was really hard for me to use that bag on a daily basis just because it was painful. So I didn't get to use it as much as I wanted to, and even now I don't have wrist problems anymore, but it's still really hard for me to use that bag. So I only wear it like when I'm going out to dinner or when I'm going to the movies or you know, something like that where I'm only going to be using it for an hour or two and it's not, you know, something that's going to be heavy weighing on my wrist. But I definitely can't use it for like a whole day out shopping or running errands or stuff. It's just So as much as I love that bag, it's not something I can use on an everyday basis. And I wanted a purse that I could use every day and something that was large enough to carry like my notebooks and my planner and snacks and that kind of stuff. So, so with that being said, I knew the Neverfull would be my next Louis Vuitton purchase. It's comfortable. I can throw anything and everything in there. It fits so much like snacks, notebooks, planners, all that stuff. So I absolutely love it. It's definitely my daily bag. And what sold me, I was kind of going between getting just this original monogram print or getting the like the checkered one, the Damier or something like that. And the reason I picked this one was because I do feel that it's uh, it's a little bit more classic and timeless. And also, I love the pink interior. I just think that's so cool and unique. And anything with pink, I gravitate towards. So that is the kind of story on this. All right, now moving on to what I keep in the bag. I have a lot of stuff in here right now because. I just use this not only as my purse, but as my carry-on for my trip to California. I just got home a few days ago, so everything is still in here. And I thought it would be kind of like a perfect time to show you guys, because it's like the most full. So I'm going to go ahead and get started. The first thing that I keep in here at all times is my planner. This planner is actually from Target. It's great. I love it. It's very similar to the layout of the Lily Pulitzer planners. It's just a little bit bigger. I use this thing all day, every day. It is always with me. The next thing I keep in here is a notebook. This one's actually really cute. I picked it up at Home Goods a few months ago, and I'm a very like creative brained person. I always have to have paper with me. I'm always writing notes and thinking of ideas and stuff. So definitely good to keep a notebook with me. So you cannot have a planner and a notebook without pens and pencils and all that good stuff. So I actually just threw all of my pens in here before I left for the trip, and it all fit perfectly. So I think I'm gonna keep it in this little clutch. This is, of course, from Lily Pulitzer. I think it's adorable. It has two little lobsters, and it says, pinch me, which is so cute. But yeah, like I said, I just keep pens and stuff in here. These are my favorite pens. They're the Stadler or Stadler. You can get them at Staples or at Target. Um, let's see. I also have a few Post-it pads, some headphones. Oh camera charger. A lot of stuff fits in here. Um, a new SD card for my vlogging camera. And one random pen and a toothbrush. This is not for my teeth. I use this to clean my, uh, my ring. Next up, I do have my iPad case, but like I said, I've been home for a few days now, so I took my iPad out of there. I have been using it, but this case I got for Christmas from Michael. It's adorable. It was perfect for the plane. Okay, next up I have um, 
my grocery list from last week. I have to write out a list before I go into the store or I forget so many things. So I, yeah, I write down everything. Another pair of headphones attached to a hair clip. Next up, I have a few um, granola bars. Well, not granola bars, these are like protein bars. The brand is called Pure Protein. It's one of my favorite brands. You can get it at Kroger or Target. Um, I have the strawberry and the peanut butter caramel. Really good. Next up, I have a few pairs of sunglasses. I have to wear sunglasses every time I leave the house. My eyes are really sensitive. Even if it's like cloudy out, I still have to wear them. But this pair is from Kate Spade. Um, these are the ones that I wore all throughout that California vlog. They're just like a plain black pair. I will leave the style number for these below. They're called the Jessa. Really cute. And then the other pair I have is um, these like Ray-Ban cat eye ones. I've worn these in so many videos and you guys always ask the style number, which I can give you guys the style number, but they don't make them anymore. These are really old. They're like six years old. So they're adorable, but they don't make them anymore. I wish they still did. I also keep my vlogging camera in my purse just in case I ever need it. If you guys are curious as to what camera I use for that, it's a Canon PowerShot. Uh, ELF 340 HS. I love this. It's not very expensive. It shoots in HD. Very easy and slim. Okay, next up I actually have um, some makeup. This is the NARS All Day Luminous Foundation. I told you guys that I love this in my February favorites, and I do, and I bought it. But um, the same day I bought it, my friend Samantha actually sent it to me as a gift, so I'm going to return the one I bought and keep the one she got for me. So that was so nice. If you guys want to check out her blog, I will leave it down below. She works at Sephora and she knows everything about every product. One thing I really love about this bag is that it comes actually with a clutch, like for free. So um, this is what it looks like. So it's a really nice size envelope clutch. I love that because I got the pink interior, it also has pink interior on the clutch and you can see it on the zipper. Really cute. So in here right now, uh, I was using this kind of as like my wallet, so I just have um, my insurance card, a debit card, some hand sanitizer from Bath & Body Works, and a little travel perfume, the Bobbi Brown Beach, which is my favorite. Okay, so that is everything in the main pocket, but it does have like this little pocket on the side here. So in there I have some jewelry, just a few sweet tea jewels bangles sweet tea jewels are definitely my favorite like wire bangles i love them if you guys want to check them out i'll have the link to her site um below as well as a coupon code okay i have like the like a tag for the purse okay next up i have a nail polish which definitely should not be in this brand new purse uh but anyways it is so this is from revlon color stay it's the color 510 it's just a white color I got my nails done before I left for my trip, but of course the day I got there, one of them chipped, so I had to just pick up a white nail polish at CVS just for touch-ups. And then lastly, I just have like my ID, my debit card, and my credit card. And that is everything, so I hope you guys enjoyed this little sneak peek into my new purse. I totally love it. If you guys are thinking about investing in Louis Vuitton, they're beautiful bags, they last forever. And my plan is kind of like to keep them, and if I ever have a daughter one day, kind of pass them down onto her. Give this video a thumbs up if you liked it. Please subscribe if you're new to my channel. I make new videos every single week. Thank you guys so much for watching, and I will talk to you next time. Bye!